Good morning, how are you today? We are out and about nice and early. Much to Stephen's disgust, I've got to say. We are just at Sandbanks. Oh, you okay? Yeah. Sandbanks, and we're getting a ferry over to Brown Sea Island, which is a National Trust place. And they have the first scout camp. Where they had the first scout camp. We're going on like a little guided walk thing when we first get there. About scouts, I think. Yeah. Yeah. We don't know what it is. We don't know what it is, we'll just see. When we get there. On our walk, we found a little pathway that I think leads to the beach. We're gonna go and have a look, since we've missed our 10 o'clock ferry, we've got time. Oh, it does lead to the beach. I see sand dunes. Oh, look, it's lovely. Oh, isn't this nice? Oh, it looks like a foreign beach. Okay. It's just lovely sand. Look at all that sand. Here's a little thing, Brown Sea Island Ferries. You okay? We've got our tickets. What? Standing in the shade. Ah, oh, Brown Sea Island. Boats and sandbank run every half an hour from 10 to half four. There's no one o'clock service and the last boat off the island is five o'clock. So don't stay at night. You can camp out, can't you? Yeah. That's where, yeah, everyone else is. The, this is what we were going to do one day, but we never ended up doing it. Um, driving down, the queues are massive. You get like a little ferry across, you pay like 450 per boat. For a a little, car, for, yeah, not a boat. <laughs> <laughs> for, for a car and you just go across on like a little ferry and go over to the beach over there but to be honest I don't, like, I don't know why you wouldn't just stay on this beach but maybe they're not all going to the beach either they're obviously going to other places I'm trying to think Stephen's taking the, I'm trying to think if that is Brown Sea Island I don't think it is I think I think that's Brown Sea Island over there I think that is you think I've changed my mind look I've looked at the map I think that that is Brown Sea Island now the ferry's arrived over. I don't know why, but I think it's so cool that there's an open top bus on there. I want to go on it. Would you not like that, Stephen? Or, or I would. Another bus is going on. It's here. Oh, look, there's a, a red squirrel on the um, boat. Take it out, please. Here's our ticket. I'm going to sit outside, I think, but people can sit wherever they want. There might, there's probably shade out there. No, it'll probably change. There's some cream there. Oh, this is nice. Oh, I feel a bit seasick. <laughs> I'm going to sit on these benches, on these seats. Is, are we, this is, is, we're going to be at the back, aren't we? These seats here. Do you care where you are? This, a fold down seat. Mm. Loads of scouts are getting on. It is a tub, isn't it? We're off. information due to the very dry conditions there is a high fire risk no smoking or any type of naked flame in the countryside areas national trust members this side paying visitors this side here we go welcome to brown sea island oh here's a little map i should take a picture of the map right mm -hmm. what's on start your adventure at the visitor center and pick up your free family trails oh we should get a free family trails right we're just hanging around now because we've got this 11 o'clock well, we think we have anyway. Got this, there's no signs anywhere. But there's like 11 o'clock guided walk. So, 
closer and it's like 10 to now so we're just hanging around look at this this is lovely it's half 11 isn't it? no but yeah they say half 11 but i think that's a different thing here we go it is on we've met up with our little group we're off it's started i'm the district commissioner i'm district commissioner here in 2003 15 years ago now um, but I've been involved with the island for a number of years, so some 15, 20 years before. Oh, it's nice one. The parish church of St Mary the, the Virgin. Uh, church, um, the big industry here on the island um, was a pottery. Um, mm. Colonel War and his wife bought the island. Really cute looking. Been in the church, back out in the sunshine. Oh, it was nice in there, hey, Stephen. You need someone cool to go, Stephen. Yeah. The sea. <laughs> Florence Van Rolte, um, after the 1907 camp, Charles Van Rolte died um, at the end of 1907, um, but Florence stayed on the island, um, continued to try and develop the island. It's really nice. Some nice pictures. Yeah. Oh look, this is going to be a nice view. All along. Oh wow, look at that. It is hot. <laughs> oh, isn't that beautiful? I uh, British Petroleum. Um, surprisingly, it's actually an oil field. The centre of the island is hollowed out. Um, no. And there are now, not after the drilling, there are nodding donkeys there. There's a peacock up ahead. See him. Remember when Mum was talking about peacock? Oh yeah. Oh, is he not gonna? Oh, they only do it like to for the other one, don't they, to show off? That's why she's not making a noise at it. Oh. This stone commemorates the experimental camp of 20 boys Scout held stone, on this site. Um, erected 1967, celebrate 60 years of scouting. That's cool. Coventry Scouts, Portuguese, lots of Portugal Scouts. We've lost our group. <laughs> Quick. We're heading down to the campsite where the first um, Scout camp was. In 1907, 111 years ago. Today, yeah, they would have been there. Oh, look, there's loads of tents down here. First or a August tent. Yeah, 1st of August to the 9th, so it's the 3rd of August today, so they would have been here. Wonder what activity would have been there? Kayaking. Kayaking. <laughs> I wonder if it was a nice yeah. summer. I wonder if they had nice weather like us. Yeah, yeah. campsite. There's a, the scouts and things are actually camping. Ah, this is the site. They were on the map. There was also a house which stood literally now over out over where the water is. It's been washed away, but it's in ruins. The names of the boys who were in the original patrols. Um, many of them, uh, after the camp, uh, went off into World War One, about five or six were uh, killed and never returned. Oh. Um, others moved progressively away across the UK. Well, the heat. The heat. <laughs> Our tour has just finished. It was really good actually. Um, just to get some more information about the island and stuff. We're heading to the beach now I think. Or we may find some shade for lunch. We are not sure. It's so beautiful here. The, the name Brown Sea Island isn't very nice but it's actually a really Really pretty place. We found taps to fill up our water bottles. Look, <laughs> <laughs> no. we've got just out here. Aww. 
and they live on the We're just inside the trading post, writing our names in the visitor's book. Too hot. <laughs> Do you want your name in, Lara? Yeah. Right, we've bought our little souvenirs from the shop. They were a bargain. Now, beach picnic. One of the two. Is that what you're going to have your picnic? <laughs> I can't sit here if I can't start saying that. I forgot to vlog it, but we have eaten our picnic Actually. in this nice. Oh, Laura's still still eating on this nice shady spot, and then we are going to head to the beach. We're not sure if it's very nice on the island, but mm -hmm. we're still going to go and check it out. Pardon? Hmm. Hmm. Here we are. Found the beach. It looks seaweedy. Not sure. We're gonna go in. Oh, what we're gonna do? I kind of do to cool off, but it's not. I don't want to go in. I'm fine. What? There's only a bit of seaweed. Seaweed. Once you get past it, isn't it? Right. Come on. Let's go. Let's see how hot or cold this water is. It's your stony. Let's see how you. Oh, that's quite nice. It's quite nice actually. Oh, the little fish. Yeah. It's seaweed, but it'll be alright. Once you're in. Once you're in. I can't stand still. Look at these views. Beautiful. We are heading back on the boat. Perfect timing. Uh, Thirty-six. <laughs> We're back on mainland now. Oh, this should be thinking ahead actually. I don't know why I've got. We've bought this to play with on the beach, maybe. And a huge big spade for Stephen. Got a feeling this beach might be heaving. Just about to get there now. Sounds quite quiet. It does sound quite quiet. Oh, look at that dog poo. People should pick it up. It's disgusting. Let's see, um, it's quite busy. Not too bad, actually. Oh. I fell down the step as well. <laughs> I didn't really fall down it as much as because you were there. At the end. Oh, yeah, with the slow up seat things? Not we didn't walk out of no. Oh my goodness, the sand feels so nice. It's lovely, right? It's nice sand. It is, isn't it? Are you going to see now, Stephen? Yeah. Me too. Oh, what? Uh, in the bag. <laughs> Stephen is making a hole so someone can fit in it. Lara's blowing up our Lilo. Lilo's ready. Let's go. Are you dunking under fast? Ow. It's a bit stony at this bit. You might stand on some shelves or something and hurt your feet. <laughs> yeah, go on, run in. Go on, run in. I'm going to run in. <laughs> it is much later now we came home we all got showers to rinse off all the sea and salt off us and had some tea and stuff and we've just been relaxing for a little while we are heading down now into bournemouth down by the beach of the pier i think it's sort of like quarter to nine ish they do fireworks every Friday in August. They have like a fireworks show down by the pier. So we're going down to do that. We're all absolutely knackered to be honest, but we're still gonna go. We're down on the beachfront. As you can see now, it's it's dark. I made we'll come in to try and catch sunset, but it's taken us about 40 minutes to get here and park. We had a bit of a nightmare parking. But never mind, we're finally done. It's 
half nine, so we're gonna head down. I don't really know. Head down to the beach and see what's going on. Look how busy it is. It's absolutely heaving. It's heaving. Look at this cute for ice cream. How can you possibly want ice cream that badly? Yeah, beach is, uh, beach is busy. Uh, we're down on the beach, there's so many people here, like they're having barbecues and they're drinking and like they're set up, they've got like tables and they've set up for hours it looks like. This is our spot, I'm assuming the fireworks are above the pier there. Okay, yeah. I said yeah. yeah. Whilst we're waiting for the fireworks, I'm getting my legs buried in the sand. You should have dug a hole first. Should have dug a hole. Ooh, they've started! Oh, that was, yeah, bang on time. 